good morning friends in this video i came with one uh, surprise element or uh, which we have you wouldn't have expected okay so we know that a plant can be assigned to a vendor so during intercompany stvo process and all we use that one so the vendor number will be there but it acts like a plant we can assign only one plant to the vendor okay in which table it is getting saved that we are going to see now so for example go to mk02 take vendor gkv1 and purchasing organization go to purchasing data here if you go to extras there is a tab called there is an option called additional purchasing data in this additional purchasing data you can assign a plant to your vendor okay in which table it is getting saved click on technical details see it is stored in lfa1 so it is stored in general data for gkv1 plant you can for gkv1 vendor you can assign one plant for example i assign gkp4 and save it okay so one plant can be assigned to one vendor that respect to field is stored in lfa1 table but not in lfm1 because that is available in purchasing data so you may think it is available under lfm1 but it is available in lfa1 for example go to sc16n give lfa1 table and give the vendor gkv1 gkv1 is assigned to which plant you can double click on this see gkp4 plant is assigned so the plant assignment will happen in additional purchasing data under purchasing view but the field is stored in lfa1 and uh, one plant only can be assigned to one vendor you can do the same negative testing go to mk02 give gkf v5 vendor go to extras additional purchasing data try to give the same plant see plant gkp4 already assigned to vendor gkv1 so you cannot assign same plant to another vendor see how beautiful that message is written you don't have to verify it didn't say that plant gk4 is already assigned to another vendor so then you have to search which vendor so they have given clearly that's why whenever you work on any customized message try to give that kind of clear information so now the person doesn't have to run anywhere plant gk4 already assigned to vendor gkv1 it's clear information is given i hope this video has helped you to understand a new point a plant can be assigned to the vendor we learned here and that is assigned under purchasing view extras additional purchasing data but that is stored in lfa1 and one plant cannot be assigned to more than one vendor all these points are interview questions and for your understanding and for your knowledge i hope this short video has given you certain interview questions and answers and also an understanding about this functionality thanks for watching if you really like this video share with your sap circle keep sharing and keep supporting our videos and keep learning thank you